Hey guys, how are you doing today, man? This is your boy Ruggy, man. So subscribe to this YouTube video, man. You guys subscribe to me, man. And today's video is about resolutions. What are your resolutions? My resolution for the year is not to procrastinate. I want to make videos, so for every time I'm making videos, I am not procrastinating. To make a video, I need to write a script, think about a topic, write a script, edit the video, post the video, and that is a complete cycle for keeping to my rules and goals for the year so not to procrastinate so let's see what other people's resolutions are for the year man doctor asked me to spend at least one hour per day on the treadmill <laughs> so i to run 1000 miles this year so far eight miles down in four days yeah yeah you 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 get there you get there you, you, that's how it starts just you just have to just take very little baby steps man I don't call them mere resolutions. I prefer the term casual promises to myself that I am on I'm under no legal obligation to fulfill. <laughs> I'm a this guy's mere resolution, man. Survive! Yeah, just have to just go through. Went into the new year with COVID even after both shots and booster. So this is all I want to put down, man. Yo man. New year resolution is not to procrastinate as much bro me and you man me and you simple as that my year in books 27,699 pages read 105 books read yeah man this is my journey in books in 2011 guys that was awesome man i am on this journey too i read books and enjoy reading books man books are so amazing it's like you never know what to expect but when you finish it you're like wow that was a good read yeah. Like one of my best books for this year has been The Power of Noun, uh, The Untethered Soul. Those are the, my two favorite books. Then, um, Outwitting the Devil. It's an amazing, an amazing book, and everybody should read it. When you read it, then you realize that even your the people you love are actually trying to bring you down. It really because they love you. They get, they'll tell you, oh, you don't travel, oh, no, don't travel. The roads, the roads are, are not safe, or you just you just want to do stuff now you just want to just go somewhere or be something or something you've never done before they'll tell you not to do it so you want to probably go into music they say no don't go into music you're not going to make money go and be a lawyer go and be an, an engineer go be a professor <sighs> lost very good friends and family last year decided to enjoy present day and i'm visually happy with my life now power up now right now this is the only moment we have this moment you're watching this video is the moment that you are sharing with me and I actually sat out at one moment and made the video. The power of now is all that matters in life. True. The only time you have right now is now. What you do now is what you it will tell me what you do next. What you don't do will tell me what you won't do next. Think about it. These are my new year resolutions. Play music, in jingle balls, oh, the Rubik's Cube. I decided to learn something different this year, and I'm leaving it here to feel like it's mandatory. I don't need to lose weight nor quit smoking or do more exercises. I want to learn something fresh, and these are my choices. Learn how to solve a 3x3 Rubik's Cube, learn how to jiggle three balls, play, and learn how to play guitar. And atomic habits if you read the book atomic habits it will show you how you can just start little habits by laying a good habit over your bad habits like if you like watching the movies a lot now right me i like watching netflix now so i now lay out okay that like when i'm watching my netflix right that i'll be working out now lose weight between two and two so i can go to the to the beach nude go girl go girl i'll be a guy a few years back i went to a nude beach and i really enjoyed myself i wasn't the most of fit there but still felt confident in myself so we made a point of going back a number of times that summer fast forward through the covid years and i've gained weight so this yeah year's resolution stop buying lego thank you for your order i know right you want to stop and you just just en you just enjoy them just enjoy them man. You know. I actually stopped a lot of things. I, I, I stopped drinking soda. I just stopped it. I just said, like, stop. No more soda entering my mouth anymore, man. It's like the same way I stopped smoking. That's the same way I should probably stop every other thing I don't like doing. Now. Why should I keep on doing something I don't enjoy doing? And it's a little crazy. I had a whole potato by myself today, fresh from my garden because I'm on my way to self sufficiency in pictures. Oh, alright. It's nice. You made potatoes today. Yeah. 
yeah i'm not making a new year resolution this year i'm just gonna keep doing the same thing i've been doing because i'm happy this way i don't need to change anything yeah you know you man True. i like my job i have multiple vacations planned this year i like where i live and i'm content with life oh more may your coming year be filled with magic and dreams and good madness ah I hope you read some fine books and kiss someone who thinks you're wonderful. And don't forget to make some art, write, or draw, or build, or sing, or live as only you can. And I hope somewhere in the next year, you surprise yourself, man. This should be your motto for the year. Awesome. Awesome. Really. My goal for the next year is to get better at self promotion i'm going to finally open up my online shop and stop letting my guys get in the way just do you man focus monthly goals yeah you know work hard in silence let your success be the noise boom 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 new year new me no more getting no no more going out i burnt off all my fingerprints the bar how can we stop public urination <laughs> yeah oh more camera fuck go to youtube don't pee if you pee we video you and you can you'll be on youtube <laughs> one of 25 books one books ahead of schedule also so you want to read 25 books this year i'm going to I'll join you i read a lot of books i'm now going to actively talk about all the books i'm going to be reading every day man so join but i'm currently reading one now right now it's called this book for yourself the millennia fast lane get this book on amazon click the link in the bio here to get this book and you type it later. This is the best book to actually use to start your day. Start your day reading the Millionaire Fast Lane and do your year. And I guarantee that the, the steps you actually take throughout this year would amaze you. But it will actually show you the difference between the fast lane, the, the, the sidewalk, and the slow lane. I understand that the decisions that they make in life, eh, the total decision is the total summation of where they are currently right now. And most times, eh, people are hoping to be rich, to get rich. But they are thinking that you have to work for for forty five years to so kind of achieve that freedom you would get now. That's money for life. So it's as if they are just trying to make sure that they have enough money till they die, right? And now life now tells you, oh, you have to now work work for five years of your life so that you be able to have that assurance of of living well when you're old. Man, guy, you you're not you're not supposed to be living life for your old age. You're supposed to be living life right now. His mutual phone bought him a Lamborghini at 25 years old. No, no, like that's that's most people that you see around that they drive exotic cars. So they're in their old age now, like they're they're old already. They have worked all their life and be able to now so we can now can I afford this man. But there's actually a fast lane that in which you can actually get to where you want to go to where much faster without having to sacrifice your life your full life you, you don't understand how valuable life is we really spend our time uselessly now thinking that it's free and it doesn't cost us anything but really that is your life essence that you are spending and when people pay you you get for for the, for your time you know like 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 most people don't like their jobs now like like people go to work and they hate it and they do that for like years and years and years guy you, Read this book. There's nothing else to say again about this million. You can read this book. You can buy it from Amazon or go to Audible and use my affiliate code Ruggy, yeah, to get it. And you get your first month free. But the first lane is one book. You will see what it takes to be on this fast lane and the slow lane. Really, eh? if you if you're on the job, no matter how high paying the job is, and you spend most of your time at the job, like for like for five years at the job or or from Monday to Friday, you are busy at work and it's only and then you're looking then it's now Saturday and Sunday that you now use to now rest and then you now have vacations like once or twice a year. Okay, you can you can feel contempted, but but really eh, you're just not even thinking as far as as, like, as big as possible now, you know. And then you, you, you know you, that is the slow lane of how to live life, you know? But because the fast lane, because it's just like you're just like saying, Oh, you bet five and win only two. That means for every five dollar you spend, you will not gain just two dollar. So you, you lose five dollar not to gain two dollar. That's a deficit. That's a deficit of minus three. Your life, you I think you're losing the game now. You're not even winning the game now. There's no way you're gonna win that game, right? Because really, there's a way you walk here that is like seven zero. 
seven days off for you and you're not giving anybody any time you know you just you just doing it and most times then uh, if you can automate a system find a way in which money can be generated uh, without you having to be directly involved with that stuff uh, that is one of the ways to have to be on the millionaire fast lane 